Hi, okay. So I kind of want to talk about a little bit about um, some search engine optimization for uh, Smug Mug. So here you go. I've uploaded a, a bunch of pictures, and I'm going to, once you're done uploading them, you can kind of bring them up. One of the things you want to do is you want to click on the Organize button right off the bat. And then you have all these options. You can select them all, you can trash can stuff, you can download, you can publish. And, but what I want you to do is I want you to go to edit, and then I want you to go to caption and keywords. And uh, since I post both in Flickr and in SmugMug, what I want to do is I, I've already poked in all my keywords and everything else into Flickr. So I just, I'm going to just peel them off, copy, paste. And this will take a minute. And one of the things, because this is a huge gallery, there's 644 in here, we're going to get an interesting error with Smug Mug that I kind of want you guys to, to see why I'm at it. And then you just click on Preview. And then there's all your captions are in there and good to go. And you can do the same thing with your keywords. You want to limit your keywords to like about 50 at the most. Keyword stuffing is generally frowned upon. But you really just want to pick the top 25 25, yeah, but roughly 20 to 25 keywords that you want. And then just click on Preview. And then there's what you've got cooking. Once you've got this thing all done and you see the little it stopped loading bit, just go ahead and click on save. And what's going to end up happening is this is an interesting thing. When you start getting into really large amounts of pictures in SmugMug, what will end up happening is it will go and it will try to do its thing and then keep on going and then keep on going. It takes a while for it to do its thing. But after a while, what it does is it times out. And then you'll end up with this really interesting kind of flaw error page but that flaw error page actually really doesn't matter it actually kind of makes it all work a little bit easier and a little bit better so while we're kind of waiting on this to go pictures are fun as you can tell we did this at a haunted photo set yesterday um, for Joe Teeples in the haunted New Year's so it was kind of fun and kind of uploading the pictures and there we go you don't need to deselect or select them all you just need to go ahead and poke them in and click on preview and it will automatically put them on all of the pictures that you've got and it takes a couple minutes for this thing to time out. So you can tell we're kind of at that awkward stage in the video or waiting for something to happen with a computer system, and then it airs out for you. Now this doesn't mean that it's really fully aired out. What you want to do is you want to go back to the organizer, right? and what will end up happening, then I want you to take those keywords, and I want you to click on settings. And then the meta keywords, I want you to paste all those things, and you can just do control V for paste, and then go ahead and save it and then you click on done and what will end up happening is if you take a look at your picture all your things are there so even though it aired out because I had so many pictures in this gallery it still took so that's essentially how you do keyword tagging just go ahead and click on organize then you want to make sure that it loads up you want to click on keywords and captions right under the edit key if you want to add a watermark adjust your thumbnails however you want to do it enhance and then the other one is click on settings, you'll get this, your title description, then your meta keywords, and then you're basically good to go. You're done. That's it. That's all there is to setting this thing up and then clicking on done and you're good. And then all of a sudden people will actually find your website and they'll start taking a look at your pictures. So we had 17,000 at one point and now we're up to 18, almost 19. So not too bad. But that's it. That's all there is to it.